In previous two videos, I have discussed the list formula that is tan theta is equal to final list moment divided by displacement final that is WF and GM final. So far, we have discussed the case of shifting and loading. So here, we'll discuss what happens if some weight is discharged. Suppose vessel is initially upright. Vessel is initially upright. That means initial list moment is zero because vessel is upright. So now this is K that is keel and here the displacement of the ship is given. Suppose displacement of the ship is 10,000 given. Km is 8 meter. Just for sake of understanding, we'll use simple numbers. And this is kg, which is uh, 6 meter. And I have weight, which is a small w, say 100 ton. And it is located here. The distance from center line is 5 meter. And distance from keel, this one, is 10 meter. Well, uh, this weight has to be discharged. At the moment, she is upright. So, this is your port side. This is on the starboard side. So, we discharge some weight from starboard. What is the list? Now, what is the list moment cause? So here, initial list moment is zero and list moment caused is W into D 10 meter. And suppose if I discharge from a starboard, the ship will list towards port side. So I will write the direction that list moment will be towards post. So W is uh, 100 and D is 5. So I have 500 10 meter towards port. Now this is my initial list moment and this is list moment cause so I can write final list moment which is algebraic sum of both these list moments so it is 500 10 meter towards port okay just let me correct 500 ton meter port now final displacement final displacement is initial displacement minus weight discharge so it is 10,000 minus 100 so we get 10,000 minus 100 is 9,900. Now we need to see if kg of the ship is, say here, kg is 6 meter and we discharge something in the vertical direction where kg is 10 meter so this is 6 meter and we discharge something from 10 meter my center of gravity will shift up or down we need to figure it out well uh, if we discharge from top or that is upper deck well, heavy weight is down below, center of gravity of the ship will shift downward. G, G1 will come down. So this is wrong. The center of gravity will shift downward. Now, how much amount? It is just the formula. 
so let me write here g g1 is equal to w into d divided by w f w is 100 and d in case of loading or discharging is kg of the ship and kg of the weight so that is the difference kg of the ship is 6 which is given here and kg of the weight is 10 meter divided by wf which is 9900 let's go up again so kg of the ship is 6 meter and kg of the weight is 10 meter so the difference of the two in case of discharge so now this will be downward let's find the value it is 100 zero zero multiplied by 6 minus 10 the difference is 4 okay divided by 9900 zero zero. so I get 0 0.04 0 0.04 meter now uh, if we see here this was k this was g this was m suppose m has not change and g is shifted downward g to g1 so new gm which is called gmf also gm final that is gm final is nothing but g1m and gm we know it because that is given in the question km is 8 meter kg is 6 meter so gm is 2 meter well that is 2 meter plus 0 0.04 that will give me 2.04 now I have everything just put in the formula 10 theta is equal to final list moment which has been obtained here as 500 turn meter so I use this value 500 divided by WF which is 9 nine zero zero into gm which is 2.04 let's use the kelsey again put it on 500 divided by back at the starts nine nine zero zero multiplied by 2.04 bracket close i get this value now shift and 10 inverse is 1.418 1.418 1 1.418 degree or if I need to round off in degree and minutes so 1 degree 25 minute and 5.53 second 1 degree 25 minute and 5.53 second just let me cross check 5.53 second so all we have to do now just divide this by 60 so it is round off to 0.1 we can write 1 degree 25.1 now what will be the list direction so final list movement is towards port here well we need to write port we can write port here also that is the answer